Visitor, this place rarely gets any. Hello there, I'm Cedar Lemon, but I'm sure you probably know that by now, don't you? I'm guessing you got a phone call from your <sighs> melon head friend. God, that would bring up a really bad taste in my mouth. Yeah, we've got a hold of these new ones, all right. So you want the melon heads to win the upcoming war? Well. You'll have to find all these new ones we collected, and if you can't, well, there's going to be a fate far worse than death coming your way. <laughs> but since I'm a good sport, I'll let you get a head start. It's for your own good anyways. In order to access different parts of the building, Access approved. You're doing fantastic. Correct. Should I really? Uh, why not? I'm in a good mood today, so here, take this quarter from me. See if I care. It's not like you're going to need it in the long run. This is also the last time I'm helping you, so don't try anything stupid around me. It won't end well for you either way. First code has been successfully generated. Good. Good. There's your head start. So you better start running if you don't want to be the main course meal. <laughs>
again. <laughs> Sorry, got a little overjoyed there. I was so excited to see a melon head like you again. <laughs> Anyways, it's been a while since we last talked, and I'm terribly sorry about that. It's just earlier I came in contact with Mini Lemon again. Yeah, excuse the scar. A anyways, I was just thinking about something before you showed up, and boy, am I more than glad to say this. I'm glad I ran away from my mother when I did. When the melon heads took me in after we last talked, they treated me just as nicely as I thought. It's not a very sweet ending, mind you. More like a... More like a warm welcome to another chapter of a book, really. If you even... If you even heard of that metaphor. <laughs> it actually reminds me of the time I actually interrupted your conversation with Mini Lemon. Believe me, I tried my hardest to stop her back there. I really, really wanted to help you, but... I think I actually made a bit of a mistake by saying the keyword without. You know, that one time I said that I wouldn't let her speak like you without showing off. <sighs> that one form. You can, can you even believe how she was scared of me anyways? She literally kicked you and a couple of other melon heads out of that part of the group that time. Well, I was confused beforehand, but still, I can't believe she would do that. If I wasn't as confused as I was, I probably would have done something about this whole thing. Uh, the lemon heads are your enemies, right? So no matter what she said to you, take it from me, okay? When they gave me admin access, I didn't shut the amino page down. I would never shut the page down. So trust me a little more often if you didn't, okay? I never do anything rash to you, so don't forget these happy, happy things. I mean, a smile says it all, doesn't it? Well, the sun's definitely shining out there, so are you ready to go? I got a very good feeling about this one. You know what? I'm proud to say this again. It's detective time. Now, what do you say we get out of here before... I had a good time keeping control of the channel on October. Just like when I first did so two years ago. And now here I am, with what almost completely calmed it little by little, by not only the melon head soil in a row, but also a stupid tomato. Next October, you're gonna have to take all the coffee. Or, I don't know what mistakes I've made this year, and check over what not She to shows do. up? Wait, is that person still... What? No one has you still here? What the... What the hell is around me? There's only one place to go, and that's outside of the stupid laboratory. So stop sitting here, we need to go kind of stuff with the here we go. Oh, what's that? What are you saying? You work really hard and you need to double you for the upcoming war? How fast that? Do I even need to remind you how I'm now at that? Do I even tell you how you push my limit? Huh? That you're the one and only who managed to tell this stupid knowing to win another round of October? The one and only who managed to escape three consecutive times in a row? But after that, it was all going smoothly and we didn't have a death everything. I had one goal. One freaking goal in mind and you... Ugh! Because I'm not as happy. You have to screw it all up. And now, every single one of those stupid melon heads are at an advantage. Already, we're going to lose the upcoming one. It's all thanks to you. You freaking idiot. Don't listen to her whenever you do. Enjoy how uh, stupid word triggered I am right now. And that's why you won't get any discussion from even me. Because after what just happened, you get nothing, Melonhead. Nothing I say. You guys are driving me up the wall for the last time. And so, ugh! Uh, just what's gonna happen if you continue like this for God's sake. No, you know what? I'm happy to say this. I've had it. All those Melonheads you put your trust into. Trying to trick them into thinking I was the villain? It's just wrong! I'm just, I'm done being portrayed as the bad guy by you! All those times you tried to tell them not to trust little old me, that's irresponsible, repulsive, and just flat out inappropriate for you to assume. And I just can't take it! As much fun as it was while it lasted, I'm officially done with you, Vanilla Lemon. 
Done with your antics. Done with toying around with you. Done with any of it. I'm out. <laughs> oh, got nothing to say now? I get it. Being tossed down by a tomato. Embarrassing, right? <laughs> Whoa! Uh -oh. I think I just hear more man.